Hello, welcome to this first playthrough of The Sims 4. I have not played this game before. Uh, I've played The Sims 3, I've played The Sims 2, I've probably even played The Sims 1, I don't even remember. <laughs> I remember lots of fun with The Sims 2 and The Sims 3, but this is now the fourth incarnation of basically the same game. Now some of the reviews of this game are quite scathing, Sims 4, but actually watching playthroughs online it doesn't look bad to me actually. I think a lot of people are complaining about things that were changed in the game because um, people don't like changes obviously. Um, let's just play it. I'm not going to do any challenges because I don't even know how to play the game. Let's, oh, I don't want to tick that. I want to say go away. There we go. So let's just try and see the game. What's it like? This is definitely a first look. Oh, the boy, Mabiza. Ooh, welcome to Create a Sim. Here in Create a Sim, the story of your Sims begins. We'll show you how to name them, design their personalities, how they look, and when they're perfect, we'll show you how, show you how to move them into a new home and take control of their lives. Shall I see the tutorial? All right, let's do the tutorial. The same for everybody. Yeah. Personality panel. There it is. Okay, thing at the top. Yeah. Well, uh, would I like to learn about it? I suppose so. Can I just learn by pointing at stuff, though? Define your sim's gender, age, relationships, and other details. An aspiration is your sim's lifelong goal. <clears throat> Click the aspiration button to choose one. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Select the ideal category. <clears throat> well, I don't know. Can I pick one at random? Let's just wobble my finger about and point at the screen. What do I get? I point at nowhere. I point at some space down here. Right. Let's try again. Whoop. Food. Master Mix wants to know everything there is to know about Mixology. What's that? Looks like a cocktail. Okay. What's your Master, master of Culinary Arts? Uh, 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 uh. A bonus trait. Okay, let's, what's this? Sims with the essence of flavour make higher quality food and drink. Uh, okay. Click the button to select oh. traits. Well, I've clicked the button. Okay. Click the button to select traits. Pick a trait. Oh, right, I can do more. That was an aspiration. Now I have a trait. I see. Right. I haven't looked at his personality. There are four different categories of traits from which you may choose three for each adult sim. So we have his emotional traits. Um, his... Hobby type traits, okay. His lifestyle traits, and what are these called? Social traits. I can pick three. Oh, I see. So, hmm. Well, let's pick pick a category of the four first. I'm going to randomly pick. Maybe I should roll, be rolling dice for this. I've got a dice here. Yeah, I have. Okay. I have an eight-sided dice. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Six. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Do I have a twelve-sided die? Uh, no. I, th I have a ten-sided one. Can I make twelve out of this? Well, I'll... I'll ooh. 
So yeah, I could roll a six-sided die twice, but then the odds are it's going to be round about seven, because that's how they add up. Let's just pick one with my finger then, okay. Zap. Insane. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Um, next trait. Seven. It's from the same category, so pick another random one. Loves the outdoors. Hooray. And pick a third one. That's from this lot. And he is... He hates children. Okay, there you go. Oh, my name. A first and last name. Ooh. There we go. That's that. I haven't chosen his personality yet, you know. I, start, I rather think I should. Shouldn't I do that first? I don't know. Yeah, let's customise his features. Hmm. Oops, I can drag with the, the left button. Whoosh. And that was tip one, was it? Hello. Whoosh. Oh, a torque. Oh. You know, these guys, they look very American to me, you know. What should Gandalf look like, really? Oh my god. Okay. Hmm. Look at the state of these people. Well, at least you look kind of normal. Um, <laughs> oh dear, what are we going to get? <clears throat> Okay, that's Gandalf, right? Okay. Um, is that it? Personality. Ah, oh, I didn't do this, yes. Male, female. Ooh. Interesting. Young adult, okay, that's fine. Default walk style. Perky walk. Snooty. Tough walk. Feminine walk. Right, I'm going to pick one at random. How many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two. Three. I have chosen number six. One, two, three, four, five, six. A tough walk. There we go. Yeah. What an idiot, right. Okay. Clear, warm, brash. I thought it was the weather, no? This is personality type. He's brash. Okay. Or is that his voice? Okay. What are these things? What's this? Downloadable contacts, save, save household, open the gallery. Can I change his clothes or something? What's this? Yeah. Add a sim. All right, let's add another one, shall we? Play with genetics? No. Add a sim from the gallery. Add a new sim. This one's going to be a woman. Ding. And again, let's randomise her a bit. Let's see what we get. 
<laughs> Mora, hey, you bosa. Shlovajila. Oh my god. Where did the Oh, Marisma. Maybe, maybe. What shall I call her? Hmm. She doesn't. And what's Galadriel's surname? Ooh. Don't think she has one. I don't know. That'll do. Um, I'm still not convinced about this appearance. Can I change her hair? Oh, I can. Ding. Whoa. That's kind of elf-like, isn't it? I'm taking these names from the Lord of the Rings books, I think. So... Fine, that'll do. Um, for the moment. So I could have done this with the other guy as well, I suppose. How do I get out of here? Tick that, maybe? Am I going to be... Oh, okay, let's go back to personality and stuff. Default walk style. Here we go. Six. Again. Tough walk. Uh, okay, alright, that'll do. It's ridiculous. Um... Aspiration. Here we go. Um, and I don't have a. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have a ten-sided die. Right. Number two. Creativity. Painter. Musical. Best-selling author. Let's see. Two, four, six. Yes. Two. She's going to be a painter. And because of that, she's a muser. Right, now I have to pick a trait. Two, four, six, eight, seven, mm. that's it. And again, there's ten, so let's choose one with the dice this time. Zero, that's ten, isn't it? Outgoing. <laughs> and I can pick another trait. It's fun, it's like generating characters in Dungeons and Dragons or something, isn't it? Now we have nine. I'll use my ten-sided die, and if I get a zero, I'll roll again. Two. Cheerful. <laughs> yeah. And four. Now we have six options. Two. She's a bookworm. She's an outgoing bookworm. Who wants to paint? Right. Job done. Anything else? I, mind, I wouldn't mind changing the clothes and stuff. Um, I'd like to add another sim. Just for fun and see how it goes, eh? Add a sim from the gallery. Oh, I don't want to log on to any gallery. No, 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 no. Go away. Uh, no, thank you. Oh, there's, there's some interesting ones here, mind you, but still. Nope. I'm going to make one up. This, I imagine, is like the, making these two into parents or something. But um, I'm just going to add a random... Well, not totally random. Look at the state of these. Um, hmm. 
I hope I can alter their clothes at some point because these are a bit funny. Um, hmm. Well, okay, that'll do. Default walk style. Is she going to be a tough walker as well? There's eight, isn't there? Let's have a look. Two. She has a perky walk. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I like that. Okay. Aspiration. Four. Family. Oh dear. Successful lineage or big happy family. What's it to be? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six and big happy family. Okay. <clears throat> so. Sounds like a tough uh -huh. one. Uh, select a trait. Right. Two, four, six, eight. First, choose from the top row. That's a, a five. Two, four, four and five. One, two, three, four, five. And, oh dear, we have 12 here, so I can't really... Mm -hmm. I'll pick the best of two sixes. I'll make my choice. So it's either number four, glutton, or number four, glutton. <clears throat> oh, sorry, number four from this set. Neat. Glutton or neat? I'm going to make a neat, because it's going to make that game easier. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Let's choose another trait. Num from this sele same selection again, so I'll do the same old trick. It's either number three, clumsy, or number five, one, two, four, five, slob. That's not compatible, so she's clumsy. Okay. Oh, and six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Huh? Okay. Um, that didn't land... <laughs> properly. It landed on its side. One, two. It's either childish or lazy. Can't be lazy, so she's childish. <laughs> what do they do? Okay. Hmm. Fine. And what's her name? <clears throat> well. Mm. Trying to think of names from the Lord of the Rings for women. Actually, this is from the Silmarillion. But there you go. It's close enough. And can I ah. work on her some more? Hmm. Ooh, you can. I don't know what she's got at the moment, though. I mean, what if I just... If I change it, I could ruin it, couldn't I? Boink. Oh, it's just the skin tone. Okay, so I could... Make her... Looks kind of like where she came from. She could have blue skin. Okay... Well, Doof. <laughs> oh my God, oh dear. Where are we? Let's go back here roughly. Okay. Skin details. I'm not going to work that hard. Hairstyle. That I quite like. Nope. Oh, 
Yeah, that's pretty cool, isn't it? A hat. <laughs> oh my god. Should she wear a hat? What, and spoil that hair? I don't think so. Accessories. Little green, little blue earrings or something maybe. Why not? Ooh. Okay. Looks kind of weird, but that's okay. I'm not sure these colours are coordinating very well, but, you know, that's okay. <laughs> It'll do. Makeup. Ooh. I know nothing about makeup. But I would say... Let's have it matching her hair. We'll keep it like that. I'm not going to go for extremes. What's this stuff? Lips, cheeks, eyeliner, eyes. I don't want to have loads of makeup, really. Is it necessary? Let's just leave it as it is, I think. Oh, you can do more. No. Straighten her nose out a bit. Can I? Whoa. Mm. Is that all I can do with it? Blimey. Let's not damage her nose too much. <laughs> Oops. Left button, in and out. There we go. Yes, okay. We can do the cheeks as well. I think I'm just colouring them. I don't know. End detail edit mode. I don't know how to end the edit mode. Cancel. Play. Open the gallery, notification, options. I should look at the options before I play. So I should look at these two as well then, yes? Because I could probably... Where do I mess with their clothes? Because I mean, I'm, I'm finding these clothes a little bit dull, dull, dull. Let's sort out her face a bit more, shall we, first. Yeah. Well, maybe her face is okay, it's a, you know, why would I worry? The hair I've already looked at. Hats. That's okay. Actually, just as it is. Accessories. I think they're pointless on her, actually. 
makeup. What if I don't want any? How do I remove it? <clears throat> oh, I've got a whole bunch of things here. Oh, that's where I do their clothing. All right. I'm reluctant to put makeup on because it might make that look rather strange. Shall I try it? Ooh. That's quite funky. All right, I'll keep it. Why not? Everyday clothes. Yes, no. Oh. That's this, is it? I don't know. All right. I finished edit mode. Yes, no. How do I get out of it? Go to something else, maybe? Actually, if I'm going to do makeup, I should probably do some lipstick or something, shouldn't I? A bit much. It's okay. Keep it mild. I'd like to see, oh I see, oh dear, she has different makeups. She's going to wear the same, more or less, anyway. There we go, right. But I can't see her clothing now, how do I get out of here? Okay, right. Can I change her clothes? Yes. The interface is a little tough. That's much better. I'll go for that. Every day is this. Mm. It's not exactly every day, is it? Going to go around wearing that? Well, I suppose it depends on the climate a bit. That's pretty good. That's tops. How do I do? Bottoms. Mm. <laughs> right, yeah. Quite a lot of choice. Isn't this like underwear? How is that? Oh, bottoms. Yeah. I could see her wearing that, I'm just not, not that keen on the look. Um, that kind of works. It's a warm climate, that's good. Shoes, yeah, she can do without these silly boots. Am I on every day? Yeah, okay. Sneakers? Yeah. Of some sort. That's cool, okay. Formal is that. I think that's fine. Athletic. Yep. Mm -hmm. 
know. <laughs> Zone Samush. Hmm. Yes, Ishi. It's not bad, actually, is it? Sleepwear. What? That looks terrible. Let's try it. Uh -huh. No. Nah. It's more like it. Uh -huh. no <laughs> nope, I'll we'll go for that out of those choices. If I'm to have a style at all. Party wear. How do I get rid of these? Um, styles. Just pick them. I can just pick them myself, right? What's this? Oh, make a muscle, Ooh. right? She has to be. Be about right. This is her party gear, is it? Mm. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. Okay, that'll do. And swimwear. That's better. Hmm. Cool, got that. Haven't done them for her or him, Jolly Old Gandalf. So, okay, that's her everyday items. Formal. to go for brighter colours, but these things are not suiting her figure, I have to say. Mm -hmm. uh, that might. That suits her hair. Alright, I'll go with that. <laughs> Can I change the colour a bit? Uh, blue is best. Uh, hold on. Yeah, okay. Athletic. Um, I like that. I like purple. I'm a purple person. There we go. Purple it is. Sleepwear. Less is more, as they say. Yeah, that looks good to me. Party. Yeah. Blimey. Yes, it's pretty good actually, but hmm. Green and blue, purple and blue, red and blue. I'm not sure that I'm doing the best choice here.
Nice colours on that one, of course. But actually, this one kind of worked the best, just as it is. Yeah. Oops, more. Oops. Swimwear. She likes blue, right? Or stripy something? Doesn't look right, does it? Well, mm, I don't know about these things. Let's ah. go with this in some color scheme that will suit it. It doesn't look right. I know. Yeah, that's pretty good. So, okay, and Gandalf, we got some clothes for you. This is every day, right? I know you're wearing a, some ridiculous shoes. Let's make them boring. Okay. Gonna keep this? What do you think? Um, I think I'll keep that. We'll go for four more. Hey, I like that actually. Just as it is, pretty good. Oops, lift my arms slightly. got a tough walk so I'll give him a few muscles. More than I've got anyway. Athletic. Is this it? Oh my god, I don't want the hoodie. <laughs> Other than that, maybe it'll be alright. Athletic. What have we got here? Hmm. I'm sorry, I don't like these things. That uh, I think that that length just doesn't work for me. It looks peculiar, but that's great. Mm. Australian colours, don't you think? And he's a gamer, perhaps. I forgot what his personality is already. Mm. Did I ever set it? Don't remember. Oh, sleepwear. Right. What's our lad gonna wear for sleep? He doesn't need a top. I think he'd go for something like that, don't you? I think that colour actually suits him, as it is. Does he need a top? Okay. Party time. This party gear isn't bad anyway, actually. It's kind of like the formal wear. Oh, oh, oh. But... Hmm. It's 
bit much, isn't it? Hmm. He likes his cardigans. E. That is party wear, I, I will agree. That actually suits him most, I would say. Prince Gandalf. We're looking at well mm. those, I suppose. They're still a bit long for my taste. Mm. It's probably right colour for him, isn't it? Somehow. Okay. Muscly. A bit more. Oh. oh, whoa! Super buff. That's too much. That's too thin. That's probably that reasonable. Okay. Now what? Save household. Or play. Yeah. Mm. Well, the two of them from Lord of the Rings, but whatever. I don't want to share it. What's this? Just save? Yeah, there we go. Okay. And... Now, I should look at his personality, actually. Did I do anything with it? I have no idea. Just this. He wants to be a chef, right? Let's hope I can remember all this or we can look it up. I want to check the options because there's always something. Well, I've turned the music down. I hope it's not too loud for my voice. I won't know till after. Music. I'll let it play what it wants. So, so. I'm a member of a YouTube partnership now who pay royalties to music companies. So I can play music, I think, without too much in the way of copyright strike danger. Nothing's happened so far anyway, so hopefully it's all right. Autonomy. Full. Ah. That means if they're left on their own, they go do whatever they want. Auto age. Played Sims. Do I want them to age? No. Does it. But auto age. Okay, my sim will not age. Well, why do I want them to age? Sim lifespan. Hey. Well, keep it normal, but I'm not going to age them, right? An unplayed Sims. Turn it off. I'll think about aging. I don't know. What's a traditional social? I'll leave it as as whatever it is. Yes, saved. Okay. Edge scrolling. Okay. I don't know how the camera works. Screen capture, well, I'm not likely to do that. Other. Login, why? Auto reconnect, I don't know. I'm not using the online stuff anyway. 
So that's that. Shall we actually play now? My Sims need a place to live in the world. We'll show you several perfect homes in Willow Creek and Oasis Springs. The home you choose offers you unique neighbours and activities, but don't worry, you can always visit or move to any of the worlds in The Sims 4. Select a world. Ooh, Willow Creek. Looks nice. Oasis Springs. Ooh. Newcrest. Which, 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 which. I don't know if I'll even. Well, let's see. Two, four, six, yes. One. Willow Creek. That's probably where everybody starts. And I have 24,000 simoleons. Click this lot to move in. It's got one bedroom, one bed, and one toilet. That's not good enough. I cannot afford this, cannot afford, cannot afford, cannot afford. Do, 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 do. Non residential. I cannot rotate the screen either with my mouse, so I have a choice. Next tip Daisy Hotel is cheaper, one bedroom. What's this? Two bedrooms, which which could be good because I have three people, <laughs> right? And they're not even set to woohoo yet, as far as I know, or anything like that. I haven't edited any relationships, so they don't have any relationships. I think fifteen thousand. This is slightly more expensive. Oh no, it's slightly cheaper. Twenty by fifteen, and this is the same. Streamlet single. I'll go for this one because it has two bedrooms or beds or something like that. We'll see when we get there, hey? Confirm. Furnished or unfurnished? <sighs> Let's furnish it to save time. Use the B shortcut key in build mode to quick, quickly select the wall tool. B for wall. Huh? A live mode tutorial? <coughs> Shall we do it? Yeah. Let's cover the basics. What the heck do I do? Zoom, scroll the mouse wheel. Hey. Hold the right mouse button to move and rotate the camera. Where are they going? He loves the outdoors. Hooray! Camera change. Click the camera controls button top right. Top right. Okay. Hey! Right, okay. Click twice on different sims portrait or once on the current sim. We haven't even looked in here. What what have we got? <laughs> Look at the way she's walking. Funny. Come on. Come in. Yeah. You can pause, speed up or slow it, okay. Action queue. Instructions here. This has been furnished quite well, hasn't it? Okay, that's it. So, oh, emotions now. Right, oh dear. 
There's a lot to learn, eh? Sims can experience an entire range of emotions that will change their lives in big and small ways. We're going to make your sim inspired to demonstrate how one of these emotions works. From there, their emotional lives will be in your hands. Great. Inspiration! Hover over the emotion to learn about it. Positive emotions grant your sims powerful benefits. Inspired for three hours. Pleasant conversation. Building from relationships is cause for happiness. Okay. Look, there's a whim. She wants to view a piece of art. Meet someone new. Well, she's meeting these guys. Finish reading a book. Cook. She wants to cook. Okay, I think I'm getting it. Um, how do I rotate the, the camera? Oh, with the, the right hand button. Right, okay. Uh, Skills. Your sim has gained the cooking skill already. And there are other types. Okay. That's nice. Well, and he is, what, reading in the bathroom? Of course. I'm. You do, don't you? Where's their bed? Is that it? Oh, there's... Oh, good. There's enough beds for them. Uh, well, which ones are going to sleep together? I'm thinking with... Um, Luthien. I'm not going to control her at all. I'm just going to leave it. Somebody get the door. She's done it because I didn't click on him properly. Okay. Well, hopefully she'll finish the cooking. Yeah. Oop. Whoa. I'm having difficulty here controlling this. Can I move it with the arrow keys a bit? Yeah. Okay. I'm thinking. I'll leave her to run just on instinct, and we'll see what happens with her. Mm. So I don't know. But how is she? She's uncomfortable. She had some fruitcake? Oh. Well, he might as well... Ask about the food. Ah. Oh, I can see her out of there. Okay. Ah, see? In instincts made her uh, go and chat. Right. Nothing in the inventory. They're friendly a bit, good. She's improving her charisma. She wants to be of a big, happy family. She wants to spend a thousand on kid stuff as well, right, okay. Well, that's... we've started, right? <clears throat> I think this is basically a good place to stop. That's the first hour. 
and we shall see how it goes. What is she picking up there? Oh, she's all the plates. Oh, of course, she's neat, isn't she? Yes, I remember. How about that? That's very useful to have a neat person in the household. Anyway, I'll stop here and we'll see how it goes next time. Bye for now.